What next? Uh, and I think the answer is just a second. Um, I don't know. Quest for Glory. I've always meant to play Quest for Glory. It's been a while. Um, I played it as a teen, but I don't actually recall getting super far. Um, I guess one question is, right, I got Amiga and I got DOS. Um, I guess let's go with Amiga. Woof. Um, I mean, well, at least there it's all going to be in one place. And I will get those sweet, tandy graphics. And it was originally done for the uh, DOS. That is the canonical version, although I imagine the Amiga one probably looks nicer. Um, okay, but yeah, let's... Uh, I did, I've been looking over various instruction manuals, and this is one I have looked at recently. I don't know what that means, so I'll ignore it. Okay, uh, Sound Blaster 16 with IRQ7. I've got 16 whole colors. I guess EGA VGA. And I've got a Sound Blaster. Where's my Sound Blaster? 16 with IRQ7. I don't know if you're a Sound Blaster. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know what's what's compatible with the Sound Blaster 16. Um. It's kind of standard, right? I do want the good music. Uh, I don't know. IBM. No. Yes. C. We'll see if this works. If not, I think I actually literally own this through GOG anyway. But, um, you know, let's do it the pure way. But you just said, I don't know, uh, how do I do this again? I don't, God, it's been so long since I used DOS. Well, the Amiga version it is. All right. So, Hero's Quest, AKA Quest for Glory. Uh, I guess I'll call it Quest for Glory. And this is Cory, or actually Lori. No, it rhymes better. Corey and Lori and Cole. I believe it was also 1989. Almost positive. Uh, through Sierra, but honestly, Sierra did not have a lot to do with this game other than, I guess, the engine. Um, but yeah, Sierra was pretty laissez-faire about... Uh, all right, how many drives can we pretend to have? All of them. See what happens. Just boot them all and let God sort them out. Um, in the meantime, it really is booting them all. That's a great illustration. Uh, 
move the character with the mouse. I suppose I could use a joystick on an Amiga, but it's too late now. Uh, yeah. Living in this crazy world. Hmm. Maybe the Amiga requires a joystick. Wouldn't be shocked. No, it seems very... Hmm. Interesting. You can change the speed. How are we doing back there? Well, we are seeing Sierra. That's a good sign. Ooh. Okay. I'm sorry. Pretty sure in a just society this would be uh, out of copyright anyway. Anyway. Not anticipate the ultimate pirate soul, the PDF. Um, this looks terrible. Why does this look so terrible? Good lord. Well. Okay, that looks more intentional. It still looks like bad DOS. Well, that those are colors you don't see necessarily. Yeah, I'm not sure how... I feel like really playing the Amiga version here is non-canonical. Boy, does that look like DOS. But, let's go to shop. I can play as the magic user in Amiga and the thief in DOS, because that is one of the exciting things about Heroes. That's very exciting. Uh, one of the other exciting things about Heroes Quest is, yeah, there's there's multiple solutions. Was that the introduction? If so, color will be impressed. Written and directed by Laurie Ann Cole. This is exciting. Programming. I mean, I guess Lorien and Corey Cole. Ah, Corey and Lorien Cole. I don't know. Sorry. The phonetics. And they were they were a, a, an adorable couple. I think they met Filkin. Uh, they were old school nerds. Uh, yeah, and, and uh, as I recall, they got this job partially because. Uh, Corey listed himself as a tournament level dungeon master because he had DM'd at some Gen Con event. I think I found some of their zines. I should dig those up. They're, they're quite charming. There's a song from Lori uh, that is a Pac Man themed song, as I recall, or something. I should look it up. Executive producer Ken Williams, the man himself. Choose your character. God, this looks worse than DOS. This really looks... Oof. Well, this is valuable for me to know about. Okay, I guess I chose. But that's good, because the combat in these games is probably terrible. Um, and the stealth. Whereas casting a spell. Alright, stats... So this, this is why I filed this under RPGs. Uh, it's because it is Sierra doing kind of a hybrid of 
graphic adventure and RPG. Um, I'm very smart. How do I make that even more? Oh, okay. Sure. Oh, I can also spend it over here. Let's do that. Let's get my magic up. Let's get a little bit of uh, dodging. I need some stealth. Oh, wow. I see. Interesting. That's going to cost me a lot because that is not what I'm built for. Whereas that I'm okay with. But I don't want to. Let's get my vitality up. Let's get my intelligence up. My agility up. Let's get my magic up. I already feel powerful. All right. You insert disc too. Uh, I'm gonna guess it's that one. That is gonna be annoying. All right, it looks like it's working. Oh, look. Yeah, this looks very... This is the dossiest thing I've ever seen on an Amiga. This seems like a quiet little town. On the porch... Oh, I got a point already! How did I do that? The porch had your two people. The same one is Rar, try the ugly, and playing with a yo-yo. The seated person smoking a pipe looks like he might be the sheriff. Listen to those sweet ass... There's some birds chirping. Let me turn this up. Some synth birds... Okay. The man with the pipe greets you. Welcome to our town. You're lucky to have made it down from the mountains before the snow blocked the pass again. It's gotten pretty dangerous outside of town, I understand. Oh, well. Guess we're trapped. Many monsters have been trapped around here with the late snow. Between them and the brigands, we certainly could use a hero around here. I am Sheriff Schultz Meisterson. This is Otto Von Goon, my assistant. What do you call yourself? What is my name? It is Jesse. Good luck in your quest, Jesse. Fantastic. Uh, okay, I can move classic stair quest fashion. God. Yeah, this is more charming in DOS, where it has an excuse. Um, well, I guess it went in there. I mean, there is a VGA remake. Uh, maybe I should just... Yeah. Well, let's... Futs around with this little... It's certainly worth... Just in a platform studies level. A bear! Hello. Welcome, welcome, traveler of the Hero's Tale Inn. I am Shimin at your service. May you find what you seek here. I seek nothing. Oh, what's all this? Okay. Hmm? Fight. Inventory, character sheet. So weird having a Sierra game try to do all this stuff. Um, ask about in. Uh -huh. That didn't seem to do much. I run this in for oh three years. Shima. We had thought to return to Shapir, my homeland, with Abdullah Du, but alas, fate has decreed otherwise. I got me a point! How am I getting points already? What happens if I go over here? Ah, oh, you're looking your paw! Look at that. Look at that. Oh, that's the kitchen. Okay. I could ask about room, I guess. Very nice room. Very soft beds. Fast and ten, only five hours a night. Okay. 
Let's stop looking at yourself. But that's good to know. I don't know how systemic an RPG this is. Do I need to sleep? I did in Neuromancer, strangely enough. Even though there was time, it didn't really seem to do anything. God, this load time is brutal. Ooh, the magic shop. That's where I should go, being a wizard and all. Is the eye following me? Yes. Yeah, this is just really working against its charm. Oh, well. The VGA version does feel like cheating because I believe it is 1992 or something like that when they uh, when they do all the VGA games. Um, that's exciting. to be a hero. Anyway, here are Corey and Laurie Ann Cole. Look at these lovely folks. Uh, but yeah, I'm curious. Well, he does start on Atari ST. Uh, but yeah, what is... Uh, See, in any other Sierra game, I would have just died for the temerity of walking near a thing. What? I have high magic powers. I put the points in. Uh, information, ask about, look at Damiano. Just as it appears. Yeah. Okay. Uh. So is the right click. Okay, right click is look. That's good to know. Um. Do not attempt to move the character by holding down the direction key. That will cause them to start and stop continuously. That's resulting in very slow progress. Well, that explains that at least. Okay, that game is immediately 30% better. That was in boldface. But the load screens, yeah, this is kind of brutal. And just, yeah. Oh my god. Jesus. I 
You can speed it up. Alright. Get the plus. Faster. Alright, let's at least uh, go in here. Then Grandma's house. Not sure what that's about. This adventure's guild home reminds you of the one in your hometown. The traditional moose head and other stuffed monsters. The Cheetor. The Antwerp. Cute. It's a city in Belgium. Even I know that. Uh, despite failing at Carmen San Diego. And you see the restoration book on the desk and bulletin board full of job listings. Alright, so... I do want to be a hero. Get closer for a good look. Fair enough. Which one's the Antwerp? The last entry, Baronet Bernard von Spielberg killed a troll near the Flying Falls on this 23rd day of September. October. See some quests. Oh. Yeah, controls. We hadn't figured out controls. No! Come back, sir. There we go. Reward for return of lost ring. Inquire at the healers. 50 gold coins for Elsa von Spielberg at Spielberg Castle Gates. That's, that's a late game. They've all gotten stolen. Well, the healer sounds like the low-level stuff. So it's got the ring. Let's see if we can bother this guy. Hey! Hey, buddy. I speed this up. God, they really didn't know how to program for the Amiga. Oh, it might be unfair, but still. We do have 12 points already. I would like to know what's going with these points. Because I don't feel like I've actually done anything. I looked at a quest. Let's talk to Granny here. She's deeply asleep. Looks like, uh, I don't know what this looks like. I was going to say the Mother Goose Sierra game. The kids game by Roberta Williams, which is probably her most successful work. And she's, the one time she's not being utterly sadistic. Um, okay, how dimensional a world do we live in? One. Fair enough. Yeah, the magic shop. I think this is as fast as it gets.
which admittedly is, you know, speedy-ish. All the loading. Smell apples. Good for me. Can I edit Twitch on here? Yes. Yes, I can. Good. It's actually a lot easier. Um... Pretty young central looks at you and says, Good day. Yep, and welcome to Spielberg. Spielberg, do you wish to? No, I guess I knew that. Fresh fruits or vegetables? Well, no. There's the dry goods store. Guess we'll go in there. What you're reading. How big a book is it? I find this less accessible than Neuromancer, even though it's interestingly parallel in this sort of graphic RPG, graphic adventure RPG hybrid world. That's just someone's house. Not going in there. One of you's gotta be the healer. That's the only symbol I don't recognize. Yeah, it's not a symbol. Uh, sure, buddy. Okay. What can I do about it? Fight? This is just, yeah, they, they just have not figured it out. Okay. How? I do have 10 silver coins. But... Is there a command I'm missing? Just type stuff? Give silver. Okay, so this is not, there are verbs and such and such that I should be typing in. It's just what a weird. Don't drink the dragon's breath. Gotcha. Thanks, buddy. I see, so ask about is really just the most common. Um, that got me a point. Uh, maybe you're the healer. I don't know. There's not much to this town as far as I can tell. Okay, 
guess not. Good lord. Okay, I, I think I'm going to have to give up on this Amigo version. It's just too brutal from room to room. Um, mm hmm. Well, that's interesting. Aw. Well, I know what I'm not welcome. Bob. Okay. Let me check. I feel like I picked this up in a bundle or something. Uh, but if not that, I mean, there's the EGA DOS version. What are other things that I feel the need to play? All of them. I mean, lots and lots of games. I could mellow out with some Shanghai, uh, or original SimCity. That'd be kind of... God, the Condor 64 version, that's brutal. Um... That would be interesting. I don't know. This is like, I'm sorry, whoever's watching this is like watching someone go through their Netflix. Um, there are definitely games in here. Uh, I don't want to really play any of these. I don't know. Maybe. Well, it's a marathon, not a sprint. Uh, the Return of Hercules. And I haven't really tried the, well, might be a good opportunity to test out the, uh, the updated Atari 800 emulator. Um, so let's see, it's quick boxer. Are there so many other games there that came up? Um, yeah, Atari 100 Mac X. Uh, where apparently they fixed the sound. Well, and I really have not used the new version yet, clearly. And I gotta go through this dumb rigmarole that Apple makes you do every time. Yes. Open anyway. Open, open, open. All right. Oh, uh, yes. A real, a real Atari OS. Okay, I'm gonna have to deal with that. I will. I will not deal with that on stream. That's too boring even for me. Um, but yeah, one more task uh, to deal with. Um, play some worms. Uh, nah, but I really would want to do the Atari version of that, and not the worms you know. Worms is just kind of a weird cellular automata. Um, just look at some worms. Uh, then I think I'll, yeah. I'll take a break. I'll come back tonight. But yeah. I, uh, I don't know. If I was streaming, like, some AAA action game, I'm sure I could play for, like, four hours at a time. Um, but these games are, they're very interesting. But, yeah, they uh, can't really, you can't just get into a flow state. I did with Neuromancer at points. If I didn't keep getting stuck on Neuromancer, I could think I could have played it for like four hours. But, uh, yeah. Okay. You do whatever you need to do. Okay, but yeah, I will, uh, I think I'll stream some more tonight. Maybe I'll figure out whether I have Quest for Glory in VGA. Um... And I think in that case, I would be up for the cheating. Or I could just go back and play King's Quest, which I need to do anyway. Um, all right, toodaloo.